I'm Brian Cook. And this is Kendra Cox. And we're here today with DiscoverWoodward.com. And we're with James with James Photographic Design. And uh, we're excited to uh, see their professional photo photography and the things they do for our community and serve our community. And uh, it's, a, it's a great opportunity to talk with them today. Guys, thank you so, so much for joining us. We know that you're super busy, especially right now. I bet you're doing a ton of senior pictures. Today's the first day of school. And so I'm sure that you guys are just running about as ragged as we are. Like last night um, was something crazy. Okay, maybe Media more. Day. Media day. Yes. Day is insane. Media day. Okay, so I'm super excited to talk to you guys. One of the things um, that I don't fully understand is whenever I read full service photography, what in the heck does that mean? <laughs> well, you know, we're a small town, so we kind of have to photograph everything. You know, we photograph families and children and seniors, and we do some weddings and commercial work, and, you know, we photograph people and dogs and houses, just everything. So whenever I thought full service, this is what I really thought. So you guys as a team, um, we talked to, I get so nervous in front of the camera, um, and I finally learned that the real trick is I come in and I say, now, after James takes my picture, will you please make me amazing? And then she does. I mean, I, you Absolutely. do your part. Like, Absolutely. you've got the lighting and you've done all the things and you say, relax, relax, relax. And I'm like, I think I am. I think I am relaxed. It's kind of how it goes, I think. <laughs> <laughs> but then, uh, Renelle comes behind you and she does a little bit of editing. And, and together, you guys make the most fantastic photographs. Thank you. So, We're a good team. Yes, you're a great team. I could never do her job, but I don't think she could do my job. Yeah. So, You've yeah. been a Woodward for how long? 34 years. 34 years. 34 plus. 34 plus, because you're going to stick around a bit longer. I, I don't know. No. I hope Where so, else would yeah. I, go? I mean, yeah. we need you. <laughs> well, I'm not going to do this forever. <laughs> Why? Help we always my, talk about working my walk and going, I remember what I think you're a big <laughs> <here." laughs> I don't want to be there, okay? <laughs> That's not your idea of retirement. Well, all right. Okay, so uh, 34 years ago, you moved to Woodward from Enid. Uh, yeah. So you're already kind of um, in this part of the, in this part of the country. Yeah, but we call this place Weirdwood. <laughs> why would anybody? Why would anybody live out here? We thought. You know? So have you figured it out? It's beautiful. It it's is great. beautiful. It's the people. It's it's mm -hmm. everything. All right. So tell us a little bit about uh, tell us about your business. If I if I want to schedule, so usually I schedule you for professional but photography for for our headshots for um, Brian and Kendra's show or whatever it is that we're doing at the time. And um, so, so tell us about how this works. We come in. Tell us all about the photography. Um, we'll well, start to you just kind of get to have desire to have some photographs made, whether it's your family or, or you know whatever. And you call us and we talk about it. We talk about what you need, what you want. Uh, we talk about a time frame and kind of go from there. You guys come in, set for a photograph, or we do it outside or wherever we do it, and then we come back in and try to get you something for your for your house, something to display that you're going to keep for a long time. Okay, so so most of us are not comfortable on this side of the camera. Right. And so um, so that's always my, my fear whenever you take my picture is, oh my gosh, everybody's going to know how uncomfortable that I am. And so I remember the first time, my very first professional headshot, um, and I'm not going to say when that was, but it's been a couple of um, days. So <laughs> I, I came in and I'm like, you've got to fix me. You've got to fix me. And I appreciated what you said. I don't know which one of you it was because I think you probably both said it at different times. Um, I don't want to fix you so much that you're not you. And I went, no, yes, I don't want to be fixed that I'm not me. Because I am me, and I'm happy with me. I just know that whenever I take pictures, I go, <laughs> like, I'm super <laughs> stiff and weird. So I appreciated the heck out of that. And I, so I wanted to just make a little comment on that. Because we see these beautiful pictures, these beautiful seniors, mm -hmm. and these beautiful families. And, um, and they're not that doctored. Like, you do, you do your editing, and, and you take care of the shadows, and you do those things. But, um, but ultimately, your subject is the subject. And I love that. I think that's huge. Do you want to talk about that a little bit? Well, you know, just I just try. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> I, I want to kind of <clears throat> expand on that a little bit. Um, and I get this from a completely different view because I'm very rarely in the camera room with him. Right. But as people come in to see their pictures, I can tell what they like by the progression of how their session went with how comfortable he has made them feel. So, especially with um, senior guys. Yeah. Or um, maybe somebody that's really shy or doesn't really know or hasn't been around us for a while. Right. You can see how their body changes and how their demeanor changes the more comfortable they get. As he's in there just having a conversation. Hey, the only time you ever see yourselves in a mirror, you're seeing a, a, right. a opposite reflection of yourself. So when mm -hmm. you see a photograph... It's, it's totally opposite from what you normally see of yourself. It's what other people see. So that's why some people go, wow, I look really good, or wow, I look really bad. <laughs> because they, they don't see themselves like that. 
<laughs> right. You know? But you know, I when you said that, I immediately thought, how many times have I said that to my daughter? I sure wish she could see you how I see you. Mm -hmm. And, and so that's what you do is absolutely. you guys allow us to mm -hmm. see us or to see ourselves, we to try. see our yeah. families, to yeah. see yeah. our pets, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and a different the good lights <laughs> and a good light. Okay. So James Photographics, you do everything. You do babies. You do seniors. You do families. And you do you do cars. You do everything. Mm -hmm. So, um, tell us how we would contact you so that we can make our appointments and get our family scheduled. Well, you know, we like to have a personal connection with our clients, so we like for people to call and talk to us. We want to know what they want, <laughs> what they feel, what, what they're looking for in the final product. So, we prefer people call, but you can email us uh, on our website, you can contact us on our website, woodwardphotographer.com, jamesphotographicdesign.com, jamesphotographics.com. Dot com. They all go to the same place. Okay. Uh, call us, 580-256-4314. That's the best thing to do. One of the things that I've always noticed about um, your ads is, is, is I see professional. You're a certified professional photographer. Just mm -hmm. hit on that super quick before I let you go. All right. Northwest Oklahoma almost only certified professional photographer. It just simply means that I've went through some testing and some schooling and some and some evaluation through the Professional Photographers of America to receive a certification. Have to be recertified every five years, which means I don't have to retest, but I do have to submit images. Sure. I do have to submit uh, uh, a business plan as to what we're doing here, uh, and I have to keep up continuing education. We have to do eight hours of continuing education per year, which is not a lot, but it is what I hate more than a lot of people do. Mm -hmm. It is. I think it's important. You know, I can remember my grandparents, my great grandparents, having photographs. Yes. And I getting to sit down and look at these photographs that they have. And, and we've even experienced this with the new digital stuff. If you don't print them, right. you will not have them archived. 25 years from now, there will be and no digital. It's, it's going yeah. to be different. That's terrifying. With, yeah. with our, whenever our daughter was maybe between three to six months old, we had to, you know, everything digital. Mm -hmm. Well, now it came to we popped in a CD into one of our computers that has a CD That's drive. A nice one. And the images are not there. Oh, wow. So probably 90% yeah. of the images so, are our daughter from the time she was born to she's like a year yeah, and a half. Because we did yeah. not print. print them. All right, so we mm -hmm. want to make sure we yeah. keep printing our photos. <laughs> All right, well, we do. We appreciate you guys so Thank much. You. Go ahead, shout out the phone number one more time. It's 580-256-4314. James Photographic Design, I can say it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for giving us your time. We know you're busy. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thank you.